Welcome back to some Total War Warhammer 2 with me, Free Wada, with the exclamation point for that added emphasis. I just wanted to get you guys on a nice little battle screen. You've been deserving it lately, you know. Uh, all I, you know, I came home uh, today. I was like, you know what? I could have done something better. I was looking at my video earlier. I was like, I can use lightning strike with Warzog. Why don't I just take out one of these armies with his army? And then we can uh, we can take care of Grom Brindle a little bit easier with that fortress together. So I have my reinforcing army over here by his side, but we won't use them. We're just gonna lightning strike it. Plus, it shows you guys what lightning strike is. It cancels out all the reinforcements from all opposing armies. It's a one-on-one -on -one grudge match. And guess what? They didn't bring enough grudge with them today. They got one grudge. I've got lots of grudge. Look at these guys, they've been grudging. <sighs> got some of that free free water tonight. Very delicious. I just had some coffee before this, so I'm going to try to be a little more awake tonight, a little more jiving, but as we all know, my brain decides to take a nap eventually. We just gotta know when that's gonna happen. Uh, I'm not very happy with this 10 uh, Wings of Magic. I'm gonna gamble it. Gambling never pays, by the way. Uh, so if you needed to know that. Um, what's a good position for these catapults? They're really through the woods, so not a very good position no matter what. Eh. We'll just put them up here ready to fire as soon as it starts. They'll start firing on some of those guys at least. Get our archers. We'll get them in the back line for now. Have Warzog up here up in the front. We'll get our giant out here somewhere too. Put our Wa over here on the side. Get these black orcs. We'll put them over here. We may run the black orcs over here just to hold the flank. And these orc boar boys definitely coming up the flank too. Rad boys. Rad boys. Now if these guys are going to be just be firing, it will pressure the dwarves to come into us. I'm going to see if I can't bait out some of their siege fire. There's a lot of trees in the way, so most of the siege fire is not even going to be too uh, too valuable. So I'm going to just see if I can make theirs a little less valuable than mine. Keep an eye on their gunner's range at all costs. Because my range is way cooler. Yeah. Vindictive glare for free. Oof. Let's get these guys back. What's their range on theirs? That grudge there. Okay, so all I gotta do is pull back just a little bit. Let's get a nice little foot of Gork over here. You guys wanted to see a foot of Gork? You got a foot of Gork. Doof. Now it seems like they are shooting at Wurzog, but I'm feeling none of that pain. I don't know if they are shooting at the Black Orcs. They're shooting at my giant! Those sons of bitches. Let's get these guys ready for the wall. We'll wall it once they get close enough. Let's, uh, let's weaken up these units that we've already been focusing up on. Get a little brain bust action. Douche! Ow, ow, ow. Remember that gunners hurt. At the end of the day, they will beat your booty. No matter how cool of a warrior you are. Now that we got Thorgrim Grudge Bear in our sights, let's throw a Vindictive Glare out of him. And then GTFO. He's very strong. Throw one of those on him too. Start powering him down a little bit. Alright guys. It's time for the wall! Let's get in there. Archers take up 
Take up your positions. Where's Og? You man the call. Three, two, one. Wow. We're gonna get these guys surrounded on uh, Where's Og if we can. We'll get a little foot of Gork action up in here. These guys are standing still. But a Gork is here. Oh, these guys are super slow. You two Arrow Boys, you go for them. You two Arrow Boys, shoot at them. Actually, shoot at them. Shoot at those Longbeards around Warzog. We'll hit up these guys. Keep the wah going past everything. We'll ready these guys for another charge, oh, Rooney. Where's Zog is about to get in there? I'm not even worried about their lord. I'm just gonna keep our giant on top of him and mess with him. Uh, if our archers want to take care of that, they can. Actually, I'll, yeah, I'll get them all firing on there. All the rest of our guys just charging down the rest of the there. Grudge bearers. We'll even use our caddies. Actually, they'll, they're doing good on their own. These long beards holding on. These black orcs doing all they can. But when the when the wa comes, the wa comes. Yeah. Oh, these guys have way cooler. These broken tusk mob have way cooler. Uh, Get ups, their little outfits and whatnot. Let's get over here. We'll get the charge in with Warzog over here. But we will make sure to use his spells on him here. Throw a bunch of brain buster, get these guys kind of curled up a little bit. These guys are all fully routing. So it's just. It's just Thorgrim. Let's see if we can get the kill on him, actually. That giant is holding him down. Okay, it's okay, giant. You've done your deed. It's time for Warzog. Shoot him down with that. Maybe we can stop him a little bit. How much does he got? 500? We got this. We got this. We got 100 on him. Oh, this is going to be close. Yes! We did it. Woo. Thorgrim Grudge Bear down. These dwarves didn't even know it hit them. But you know what it did? A lightning strike. Our giant took a lot of damage though. He uh it, he put in a hurtin'. But he also tanked the enemy lord the entire time, and that's one less enemy lord than I have to deal with. Didn't really have any outstanding uh, casualties on either side, though, after that. We took down their uh, artillery. That's very nice. We lost a bit of the use of their uh, ranged. I think in the melee, we really... We honestly kind of beat these dwarves. But their ranged units are... Whew, those gunners take us down. We get the replenishment on this one. We got enough leadership being victory peoples. People who gain victory. It's called winners, I guess, but I don't like to go by that term. Let's get the final upgrade. We'll get these black orcs going on. Stone Mine Tower, we're gonna upgrade. Let's check out what our hero's doing. 
You know, you should be doing stealing me some tech. Success tech. Let's get some... Oh yeah, he doesn't need scouting. Let's get him some hinder replenishment. Settlement upgrade available. Uh, we'll wait for now on Karag Dromar. It's in a little... It's in dangerous territory. We'll save our little bit of money that we have to do some of these upgrades uh, that we don't need at Black Crag. But maybe Karag Eight Peaks we do. See, these guys, we could upgrade to level 3. Crooked Fang Fort is a... Yeah, even though those are allies, we still want, maybe want that a little more uh, defendable. We'll, s we'll save our money for upgrading Karak 8 Peaks instead. Bark Var, though, just got their upgrade. They definitely need the final... I think we just go for the final walls and call it a day there. We'll grab some more of these. These Raiden stashes are coming in handy. We're going to start being able to raid so much. We'll just gain a billion money every turn that we raid. Let's get a level with Furzog. I wanted to look at where they were positioned. Uh, the reason I paused there... <laughs> it was my brain still working, thankfully. Uh, but... I just wanted to make sure that our guy... But I figured Wurzog could run back if we needed to. He could bounce back just a little bit. He's got some room for that. And then my guess is he's going to come here. And the wall will be with us as well. So we should be okay on that. Uh, Kenny. Kenny, Kenny, Kenny. I feel like they're definitely taking care of Kern. So I'm not worried about that. Hmm... He's got to go between Migdal, Vongol, Barak. I think we we may go to war with this west side, but I don't know how many allies he's going to have coming in on us. So yeah. I go to war with all these guys if I go to war with him. So I need to be prepared for that. Excellent time to start an army soon, but he's already coming along. Let's see, we got those orc archers. I kind of want to just get black orcs now. So I could I could go for a couple trolls and just liven up the liven up the spice a little bit, but I don't know how how truly good I'm feeling about actually doing that. Ooh, a failure. Fart toe carrier is a failure. Let's get in that turn after that. Ugh. The wall is coming back up with us. Two of the Waz. We'll send Alfie Rigby over. We'll nix those other humans that are attacking us right now so we can really focus our... Uh... Thegan's Errantry. Ooh. No. See ya, pirates. Yeah. Military alliance is broken with those guys. I'm over them. He went to war with way too many people. Even, and even though they're not close to us, we have seen that they don't care who el who their other enemies are. Unless that guy was just my enemy and that's it. And he could focus his full army over there. But he's got better things to do than mess with orcs over here, right? Um, now we could get one of those Skaven things, but eh. It's not really that... Oh, I know what we're going to do with him. He's going to be jumping from here. He's going to be going over here. Next turn we're going to take Johann Frankenwerther down. And Akendorf will be a little bit happier, yeah. Oh, our guy's besieging it. <laughs> so that's a thing. We'll get an encircling camp going on. We won't be raiding anything, but he will at least be getting some uh, refreshments as we go along the siege that we are now a part of. Zufba, negative 83 minus 3. Let's finish up some of these uh, stakes. We'll get. We'll just make sure these places are heavily defended up here. We may look to confederate these guys soon. Uh, it is the last of the Greenskins tribe. And that actually gives us a pretty fair chunk of land. But land may not always be a good thing. 
It's about the character behind the land. You know what I mean. Let's get stabbing. I can't do anything over here except for try to assassinate this guy. Critical six Elbog, man. Elbog is pulling off very nicely. Scavenge. Let's get him a giant spider. He deserves it. Giblet. Jibbles. Nice job getting that tech. We'll keep a couple keep a couple of these guys around here. Can't do that. Oh, I don't have enough money. Ooh. Money problems. That's what I'm running into. Kenny. I'm finally able to get iron hard. He's going to be replenishing after this battle like a baller. Let's get that turn ended. Wasp following along. They're going to be gone soon. We don't have to, we're not going to worry too much about the Wa. We may take just what we have with Grimgore. And go with him. Take Alfie Rigby to be the leading army. And have Grimgore learn a thing or two. Yeah. Now, I hope that is not for us. Maybe he's like, oh, these orcs are getting a little too aggressive over here. Like, no, guys, I promise it's not you. It's me. I'm just, I'm, a, I'm doing my thing. Oh, they're trying to see Jack and Dorf. Well, I have news for them that they will not like. We almost have our entire horde of black orcs as well. Let's look over here. We're going to be looking towards Myrmidons. Even though these guys have a bunch of crossbows, they don't have any rank ups. We've got the goblin army of trust. And we got Green Gore Ironhide. What more do we need? Let's get him some filler. We'll get him some filler army while we're waiting for other stuff. We could just go orc boys. What else could we do? We got the Doom Divers. We're okay on that. I don't want anything too expensive, so let's just, uh, yeah, let's just go with Orc Boys. Bam. Orc Boys for days. All that come. We'll have an entire second half of our army in one turn now. Thanks to mid game technologies. Um. Kenny's turn, I think. Let's do it. Let's do this fight. Um, I guess I should just go ahead and control the large army. But it may end up being a little... We may have some more losses, just because it's really unmanageable with a lot of units. Especially because they become... Oh, their character icons become so tiny to click. I can't do it that quick. We're going to have a very good start. Uh, we can put our catapults at the top of that hill. And they will be sitting there at the bottom of that hill. They may be up they may be up here a little bit. But we will still have advantage by being able to shoot them from over here. While they have nothing like this. And, oh uh, no, not with Kenny. We have this on Warzog. We had the extra range, I thought. But I think it was just extra damage and extra reload speed. The range comes with a tech upgrade, I believe. Either way, they're going to get crushed. They do have great swords. We're going to use our catapults to focus them down. As well as our archers, because they have no shields. So here we have them sitting in a little hole. I have catapults that will sit here. On the mid-range of this hill. Actually... How far back can we do this and still be in range? We'll, we have decent range with that. We'll put our archers under here, and then we're going to move them to the top of this hill. Actually, I can just do it like that. We'll get our orc boys back here. We'll just keep them back here ready for the wall. Kenny up, y'all. Yeah. Kenny the wizard. With the blade <laughs> and scroll of shielding. 
Alright, let's do it. So if they send any warriors up here, we do have a couple that we're just going to keep behind them. We'll get some of these warriors just like right below this uh, hill. Here comes our secondary army. We're going to just move them straight over here. Catapult focus is not where I want it to be, but it's good. They have spotted our first guy. We, they have spotted free water. That means they have spotted their doom. There we go. Check this out. Oh, yeah. We'll keep an itchy nuisance spell going on. Let's make sure to grab all these guys and put them in a group and we'll just charge them straight over this wall. This wall with the wall. We're going to grab these guys in a group. We're going to move them up here like this. We're going to just move these guys in here. We're going to get free Wada over here as well as Kenny because these guys look like they could use some assistance. Assistance. We'll make sure these guys are getting hit. All of these guys will be coming over here to attack these gunners. I'm going to have these archers go over here. And the rest of these warriors come in on these great swords. Our goblin big boss as well. I'll have them try to go for that general. Um, let's give some damage resistance to one of these orc boys that are taking some heat. We'll get him over here. I mean, that would be a pretty good spot. Actually, let's just do Itchy Nuisance while we're waiting. He will reduce theirs. Bam. Let's actually get him in here, too. Catapults are doing an amazing job right now. These orc boys are just chasing down. Pull these, all these guys back and just let our archers take care of this. Yeah, we won it. We crushed them. Hmm. Oh, oh that's so nice. 149 losses. Oh, make that 150 with Jenkins. Jenkins! Kenny and Jenkins, the dynamic duo. Catapults did a lot in this. Uh, they did exactly the job they were supposed to do. That's how I need to always use them. Bust it up. The, you can tell which ones I really hurt with the catapults because they got three and nine kills. Their general, I mean, Empire Captains can be really good. Uh, just not compared to a Lord, actually, versus a Rebel General. He did get tucked in between, too, and we had uh, all that damage reduction on him. So he's, I mean, we, he was basically just a normal soldier at that point. And we made sure, we shut every single gunner down. I am pretty amazed by that. We'll have good, uh, we'll have good replenishment already. Let's do that. Let's use Kenny, finish him up. We'll do a little auto-resolve on that. It's gonna hurt us a bit, but we're just gonna grab the replenishment now. Just to speed through that. Um, let's get Kenny... Could upkeep that would be pretty good eventually, but uh, see, there's a lot of good stuff we could get for Kenny right now. Let's get him lightning strike. We were out here to get some lightning strikes. And with free water, we got to make sure he's as safe as possible with lightning strikes. Scouting, get the next level of that. Yeah. 
Let's hop on Actendor for a little bit. Let's get that happiness going up. Grinstadt should be okay for now. I mean, Dolvon Brock, I'm not worried about. Uh, got all these guys held and taken care of. He will not be able to do much this turn. We can just go scout out a little bit. So, ooh, we could search some ruins. I don't know if I've searched some ruins with you guys yet. We get this puzzle. And the thing is, this mysterious puzzle, you have to connect these blue lines. And I have searched for answers on Steam and kind of get it. You have to rotate this face to get it wherever it needs to go. And something with these little blocks have part of it. But, you know, looking at all of it and you look at the answers and you're just trying to be like, what the hell is this? And I th actually, I think it's you turn these over here. So these two, something like that. Uh, let's try what feels what feels like it's good. Let's do that one. Puzzle succeeded. Damn, that's not happened. <laughs> that's the first time that's happened. <laughs> that feels good. We're still, I guess we're still just going to be sieging. There's no way we can attack any of that. Uh, we're waiting on our wah to start it. A wah to start. That's just going to be so... That's going to be insane though. Let's make sure we're closing up on it. We'll do a raiding camp as well. Jibbles. Steal some more tech. Failure. It's okay, Jumbles. You've stolen a lot of tech in your time. Settlement upgrade. Gronti Mingle. I think that place is going to definitely need it. It's by itself. It's still getting negative seven. We may just want to do an obedience establisher. Or something that balances it out a little bit. Eliasar on Crooked Fang Fort. Still holding on to that. Let's see what we got. Death Gorge. Death Gorge we could we could do a little work with but I think I'm gonna stay for Karak go for now they're at negative one 12 Skaven uh, corruption so yeah let's save our money for now we got a lot of time before that starts going down Karak as Karak money okay so that's what we're gonna do I get money After we just just glance at what else we can get, possibly. I'm going to be looking to get some Raiden stashes around here, too. And let's end it. Ah, uh, it still feels good. Now that... Ooh! Sorry, I dropped... I almost dropped my water. It oh, splashed a little bit. Nah, dude, I'm sorry. You're at war with literally so many people, and that is not okay with me. I'm an orc, and I don't go to that war that much. Sylvania is looking a little... Sylvania and Von Karnstein. We don't really have to worry about vampires, I guess. Maybe it is just humans. Those dwarves are just kind of, like, hustling back as much as they can, honestly. Peace Treaty? You know what? Sure, I'll take it. I'm gonna go destroy Myrmidons. With my two giant armies now. Now, Myrmidons is still gonna be fairly defensible. They don't have any extra walls, though. They got lots of spears, which we are gonna crush with our orcs. Lots of spears and lots of crossbows. Valmer Gossu. We get the flame of eternal flame banners. Oh, here we go. We did get the upgrade. We actually finally got a, uh, where was it? Pathfinder, yeah. We got a little bit of an upgrade to our uh, movement underground. Is there actually a chance I... Let's give Alfie Rigby a fireball. I want that so badly. Boop. 
Grimgor Ironhide can also jump over here. Actually, it's probably better if he just goes through the water and ends up like... Well, oh, shit. It does about the same. Let's have him go... Let's see how far these guys... It's not showing me their movement. Oh, because they're mustering. Let's come somewhere like out here. We'll still be sort of close by. Actually, let's, yeah, let's just stick to normal so we're not in forced march for no reason. Steal some more tech. Success. Farto carrier, my boy. We got one turn left now. Elbog, get back to doing what you do best. Failures. Jib the throat cruncher. Let's see if we can finish that. No, no finish on the tech, but it's still going to be researched at the end of next turn. We'll wait on those settlement upgrades again. We've got a lot of settlement upgrades and unassigned skill points to free Wada. Free Wada. I guess we'll just go ahead and finish up his uh, his vindictive glare. We'll get in case we need to have a supercharged vindictive glare for some reason. Akendorf's looking like it can stand on its own again. So we're going to move up to Grinstadt. We're actually going to force march this. Just so we can be on top of it. It's only three people, but it's my place. I, you got to protect it all the same. Alright, let's end it up. Stone Mine Tower, we'll get a, we may, may do a little bit of extra work on there. We'll just focus on seeing things that get our uh, income up just for now. It's the battle. You know what? I think I'll save this one for next time. Thank you so much for joining me. It's been a pleasure. You know, as I always say, 